Zoom. Hello YouTube, it's Akrut again, back with another video from the home studio. I haven't posted anything here on YouTube in a few weeks and I have my reasons. Accurate Accurate beats. Beats. First of all, I for some reason just decided that November will be the month where I'm trying to wrap things up and finish as many projects as possible. I have this bad tendency of starting out projects but not really being able to finish them because that's just how I am sometimes. So the five weeks of Beats EP is done and it's been uploaded and it's going to be released in just a few days. I'm going to post another video on that too by the way. And the other project that I have finished just now is the merchandise. The merch is here. Basically we're talking t-shirts, sweatshirts, tote bags and coffee mugs. That's what I'm going to start off with here. Available in three different designs inspired by different beat making tools and a fourth one that just has my logo on the back of a t-shirt. Available in black and white and a few different colors that kind of works with the design of the prints. This is one of the t-shirts right here in black. It's the MPC 2000 XL design with a small little accurate logo down there. This is the one with the SP design. This one is in white in this case but also available in black of course kind of cool too. This one is also nice. This is a tote bag with the 1210 design on it and what's cool here is that this one is really perfect for vinyl records. They fit nicely just like that and you can leave your record store in style I guess. And that's also the same design as I'm wearing right now in my t-shirt so that's what it is. And I'm not sure how comfortable I am wearing this one myself, but it's available in a few different colors too. The accurate text logo on the chest and a big one with my face on it on the back. Not really my thing to wear myself on the back like that, but it's, it's a nice design and I just wanted to make it available. So it's also in the store. The link is down in the description below. And let's of course not forget about the coffee mug either because it holds coffee. And this one actually comes in a version that has all the three designs printed on it. So the 2000 XL, the 1210, as well as the 404. So that's nice. And even though I don't use a lot of white t-shirts myself, someone on Instagram asked me to make these available on a white t-shirt as well. So I tried it out and I really like how it came out. Kind of a clean look. The same print, but on a white t-shirt. And a big part here was that I wanted to make merch for my YouTube channel and for my, my stuff in general. But I wanted to do something that I could wear myself, not just with my logo, because that's, that's, that's a bit weird, you know? I go by the name Accurate and, and the part of that is because I want things to be in a certain way, so to speak. So I thought about asking a few friends of mine who are like designers and graffiti artists and stuff to help me out with these designs. But at the end of it all, I just decided to sit down in Procreate and make these designs, export them into Adobe Illustrator and then into Final Cut and make everything look nice, you know? Honestly, it took me a few tries to get these designs just right with a place that prints them and everything. But at the end of the day, I'm really happy with how everything came out and I'm really glad that they're now available online for purchase. I'm not a designer. I do a little bit of graphic design sometimes for my day job, but at a really small scale and that's not much to talk about. This was something completely different, but I think I kind of nailed it. Honestly, I do. So I guess what I'm trying to say here is that I'm kind of proud of myself and excited and happy that this is now something. I think there is something a bit magical about being able to create something from start to finish yourself. Sometimes it's a YouTube video, other times it's a beat, a track, an EP, an album, a line of merchandise and printed t-shirts. I guess I just love creativity, even though that sounds a bit corny, but being able to make something like this makes me feel good and hopefully someone else enjoys these designs and these things that you can purchase. It is a really nice and cool way to support me and my channel and what I do. But there's also an EP coming out so have a listen to that whenever that video gets released too. By the way there's also another project that's not mine but I was a part of it. I have a beat released on this Swedish compilation album released on limited colored vinyl 
we are like 30 different beat makers contributing with our own little beats on the album. It's released on this Swedish label Shelta Records, so it's available on shelta.se and also on HHV, I think it's, I think that's what it's called. The link is down in the description below as well if you want to pre-order that album with a collection of 30 really dope Swedish beat makers. Now for how long can someone like me just talk about a small little line of merchandise t-shirts and stuff? I guess we've reached that point right now, haven't we? If you enjoy these designs as much as I do and you want to be able to purchase any of these things, go to my Spreadshirt store, the link is down below, or to my website accuratebeats.com that should also have links to the store where you can buy these things. So that's officially one of my projects in the bag. Done. Did it. Finished. Feels good. Really good. So thanks a lot for watching this video. I hope to see you guys in the next one. Until then, hore gott.